Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got some projects to share with you. Um, so recently I picked up these um, pens in an Amazon haul, um, yeah, to alter. Um, I will leave the link to that haul down below. Um, so yeah, I picked up those that I wanted to alter and um, just share with you what they look like. Um, I don't have many beads, but um, so I've just kind of used what I had in my stash. So I altered this um, metallic blue one. I just added some charms. Um, some of these are like what people have gifted me. Some of the beads are like old jewellery, off of old jewellery pieces and stuff. So yeah, it's got like a dragonfly, um, butterfly various beads i ended up putting this like um bead cap in the middle um and smaller beads and stuff so that's the blue one then made them um, done the lilac one that's that i've just used um these silver beads on there then added some um chains and again put various charms on there um, that kind of match the colour themed but this heart one and another butterfly on there so that's what that one looks like then got this black one um, I think this was off of an old necklace or something these two beads um, this one's actually got material around it um, and then put a little star um, charm on there um, I think this one picked up when they were doing all the little charms in Primark for bracelets and things. So that's what that one looks like. And then this is the last one. This one's kind of like a glittery. It's got glitter in the pen. Um, yeah, various beads. Put one of these little ones on there. And then this is one of the tassels that I hold again from Amazon. Um, just added a bit of chain and hung one of those on. And I think they go quite nice on the uh, the pens because they're not too big or bulky. And you can still, you know, use it. You don't want anything too bulky that you won't be able to use. So, yeah, I'm really pleased with how those turned out. Um, so that's that. Then I made some cards using this paper collection. I picked this up from the range. Um, again, I have hauled this, I think, in a previous video. Um, so yeah, it's just cut apart pieces, um, some vellum with words on and stuff, sentiments, some stickers. So as you can see, I have used various bits. Um, and then these are the cards. It's just some thank you cards I've made using basically that, that collection. Um, so the card bases, I think, were from the range as well. And they're just the gatefold, gatefold um, card bases. They're already pre-made white cardstock. Um, so yeah, um, I have stamped thank you on each card as well. So and decorated some inside. Um, so yeah, just um, these papers that I've used as well came in um, this collection. Yeah, so it had hold on, uh, it had eight eight different papers in there and I've used pretty much every single one um, so that's that one then this one again these are just the cut apart pieces from there some have um, popped up on foam and some I, I haven't and um, again these the tags stamped thank you that one I've left plain inside and then this one um, I like the little gnomes that come in this collection. So that's that one. And this one, you've got a little, um, this you could make it into a lemonade stand because it did have um, some parts in here to make it into a lemonade um, stand and stuff. Um, but I kind of switched it up and made it into like flower pots and things. Um, so yeah, I just like the way the gnome's got a little watering can there. Um, the tag says thank you. 
um, that's the inside so yeah I'm really pleased with how these turned out they were really easy and quick to make um, these came with some fruit with sweet little faces on this is a vellum piece it says a big thank you um, I didn't um, use a stamp on this one I used that it only came one with said thank you in there um, the other ones kind of say more a birthday kind of thing um, put the banner stop that to one side and then that's the inside so that's that one and then this is the last one um, so yeah these are all um, individual cut parts and I just made it look like they were all in the vase together and that's the inside um and that's it guys that's pretty much all i have to share with you oh i did um i'm not sure i finished the um these um i'm gonna give these out to um my little boy his teachers have made them one each it's like a key ring crocheted apple i'm not sure if i've shared these or not on here um so yeah i crocheted some apples put a little face on each one done a little stalk and leaf um and then added um you know the uh keychains with the little tassels i hold from um amazon yeah so and i've left it plain on the back um yeah so um i've just added it on to like a tag um, I think I'm going to write a little message on the back of each one. Um, but I'm not sure how to gift them. I have put them at the moment. I might um, use them in these like little clear bags and put a topper on it. I'm not sure um, on how I'm going gift, to gift them out yet. Um, but yeah, yeah, so I've been making finished all those um just need to package those up and um yeah that's it guys that's all i have to share with you today i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and i will catch you in my next one have a great week take care bye